Hi, how are you? This is going to be for my Pisces. From the week of the 13th to the 19th of November. I hope you guys are doing well. Pisces, this is going to be for you. The first card that fell was the Eight of Pentacles. So, this is the tower. Oh, and the pack, the deck of cards I'm using is my Affirmator's Tarot deck. Okay. So, the tower. Page of Wands. A little off balance with money, the tower, something happens suddenly. However, you seem like you were happy, but at the same time, you're running away from something or running towards something. The Nine of Wands, you're getting out of something the way you feel. This chaos. The Queen of Pentacles. This is the Earth sign energy. She's about money. That could be a Virgo. A Capricorn. Or a Taurus. This could be about your finances. Queen of Pentacles and the Eight of Wands. Something you wanna, something you're going after. Something that makes you very happy. You're going after something that makes you extremely happy. But right now you're stuck. You're stuck. There was a lot of chaos and confusion in the past. But something is coming towards you, or are you going towards something really fast? It seemed like you were off balance where money was concerned. Something happened. It could have been. It could have been um, something came crashing down with money. But then I don't understand the page of wands. Why the happiness? Just lay down. Lay down. Lay down for mama. Just lay down. I, I know. I know my job. <laughs> you see these apples? How come? Give me a few. You just woke up. It's early in the morning. You noticed I wasn't around. <laughs> I don't know why this... Whatever happened made you happy or made somebody happy. Maybe you had a problem with money. You were off balance with money. And for some reason, it made somebody gloat. Like, but why? Whatever it was. 
is so cool. it could just be the energy of the person i don't know or the situation i Running from it though. You're running from some kind of situation. Something you don't want. Anyway, where the money is concerned, you have a difficult decision to make. I got the two of swords. You're weighing your options. But you're all in your head, okay? You're not seeing things too clearly. I see you deep in meditation. When you're thinking about something, you're kind of restless too, possibly. And what you're thinking about has to do with love. Was that what crumbled around you? Love, you used to be happy. Lovers over here, okay? So maybe all this confusion was about love. So above the tower came the strength card. So that tells me about your inner strength, okay? Whatever happened, you're trying to get to find yourself. You're looking within, probably. You feel like you were betrayed. Like someone stole something from you. It could be emotional, okay? <laughs> and I said you're going with them. That's the hermit. Okay, and this was the seven of swords. So, you feel like somebody betrayed you for some reason. But you're going with them and you're going to... Searching for something. Maybe you're searching for happiness. Maybe that's what this is signifying. Where is the happiness coming from, huh? It's not from this Queen of Pentacles. That much I I can see. something not nothing bad I don't maybe something negative I mean that's the five of wands that's about co conflict so you're happy feeling here I think you did it yourself that you're not if you're not happy right now you know but I see you got a good imagination it's the Knight of um, Cups. You're romantic. Creative. And you're going to put your challenges be Your challenges will be below you. Will be. You'll overcome them. Let me put it like that. You'll overcome your challenges. So, whatever happened here. This, you were... I think you're going to balance out that conflict, that unhappiness. But let's see. I see the nine of wands.
the nine of pentacles above the nine of wands you're running towards your dreams the knight of wands something coming fast and you shall have victory the six of wands so whatever is happening here the nine of wands whatever you're running away from or whatever you ran from Or whatever you're feeling, you're going to come out of the feeling. It's like coming out of something. You're running away from that horrible feeling. You will have a pretty positive outcome. Let's see the Queen of Pentacles. This is about money. This is about thought, you know. This is feminine energy. It doesn't necessarily mean feminine though, okay? This is just more in thought. Ah. More in thought. Oops. This is more like being in thought. The queen. That's about money. You're thinking about money. Ways how to increase the money. Oh. You need to do some shadow work. I got the devil. I got the ace of wands. And I got the five of cups. got an unhealthy attachment to something some kind of behavior you're doing is not good some kind of destructive behavior You need to look within, do some shadow work, go back to the past and visit. I see you have a new project at hand. You got the urge to create, you better be careful you don't create, create. This is the ace of wands, right? And that's like fertility, new opportunities. It could be um, new beginnings, that would be nice. And whatever happened in the past here, you're going to accept it. You're very sad about it. But you got to forgive yourself, okay? Forgive yourself. Let's see the Eight of Wands. The Eight of Wands. Somebody's going to communicate with you at the King of Swords. They are going to make sure they communicate with you. They're going to be truthful and they're going to be very honest. And it's going to give you, <laughs> you're going to get new messages, okay? You're going to get new messages. This is the Page of Cups. You're going to have some very clear communication. There'll be no doubt in your mind after you get the communication. Whatever you're thinking about, whatever's going on, whatever this thing about love here, 
and about money. Whatever is going on is going to all clear up. You're going to have a happy surprise. Page of Cups and the King of Pentacles. You shall start acting towards getting the money. Wealth, business, you got good leadership, security. Maybe it has to do with your job, protective, authority. But you're very generous, okay? At least to those that you love, you're very generous. So let's see the sun. Cards ain't too bad, you know. They ain't bad at all. They're not bad at all. You got a little stuff going on. You're hoping and you're wishing for something. Happy family. Divine love. Oh, who doesn't want that, you know? Just a happy relationship, inner peace. Seems like you want marriage and love and commitment and family, you know? But right now you feel out in the cold. Oh, and I got goosebumps. You feel like you don't have. That's because of your mindset, okay? Start thinking positive. Whatever you're working on, you got passion for. So this out in the cold feeling might be going away soon. Let's see what's going to happen. We got two more cards. So this is the Eight of Pentacles. You're working on something right now. But you're stuck. Remember, you're stuck. You got the hangman over here. You're stuck because you got a broken heart. Got a broken heart. You feel betrayed. However, darling, luck is on your side. You might turn around this broken heart. You got karmic good luck. Got the Queen of Pentacles again. You're very nurturing. You're very practical and supportive. So you're an emotional person. I mean, you're Pisces, you know? You like to provide financially for your family and things like that. I got the Queen of Pentacles. Like I say, you know, those are those could be your qualities, you know. Now, what is coming? The Ace of Wands. Let's see what's coming. Ace of Wands. What is coming? You're gonna be saving money. You're gonna be balanced. It's the Four of Pentacles. And that's you. So you're going to be doing something. You're going to be emotionally balanced. And then the Page of Swords. You're spying on somebody. It says um, new ideas. Curiosity, you're thirsty for knowledge. You're also restless and you're spying. Who are you looking at? The person you love. The person you love. The cards look pretty good. However, you're feeling, I think you're going to come out from. You're going to rise above those feelings. It's a little turmoil. It's chaotic. But the long, the bottom line is that you want to have a happy family. I do see that. No matter that your heart was broken. I do see that luck is on your side. I do see your, um, your emotions are coming back or they've always been there, you know, I mean, you're, 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 you want to provide for your family. You, that's what you're, you want to do. You want this love back. 
you're missing someone. You're going to start saving. You're going to start feeling down. Switch your emotions again. So it might work out, okay? But don't give up. Just go about it the right way. All right? I love you guys. You take care of yourself. And I'll see you soon. Bye.